real quick, you guys, all episodes from season three and season four are up on Patreon right now. The full uncut reaction with all the volume up and it's completely unfiltered. So if you want to watch the entire episode with me, check out my Patreon. Other than that, let's get into the episode, you guys. <clears throat> oh, we're getting right into it. Okay. <gasps> oh my god. I'm literally about to cry. This is so weird. Seeing her perspective. I really wish we would have got a season of Vilda. Give us a season five, please. Ooh, I'm, I'm about to cry. Why am I about to cry? I can't believe this is the last episode. I'm good. I'm fine. I can do this. I can do this. That's a terrifying doorbell. This is so weird. This feels so weird. God damn it. Why didn't we get a full season of Vilda? There's so much that we don't know. Damn, how many bills has she not paid? Oh. She needed that. She, like, if there was a perfect time to send that, that would be right then. Not gonna cry yet. Dude, it's too soon. I know I'm gonna cry at the end. Nope, stop. I'm good. I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh. Vilda. Please tell me the girls know about this. Make a season five about this girl. There's so much that we don't know about her. Mm. She's not gonna tell her. Oh my God. Holy shit. Nope, I'm not gonna cry. Nope, nope, it's not happening. Uh. Mm. This is bizarre. Whew. Is that Chris? Oh my god, I hate sleeping next to somebody and they're that close to you. Are they gonna end up together? Oh, whoa! Mm. This is so weird. So I do that, so then... <laughs> he is so cute. Yeah, what's a true dream? <laughs> At least she knows that. It'd be kind of cute, though, if we saw more of them, too, and she ended up kind of changing his ways, kind of like William and Nora. Oh, he totally wants to. He looks like such a good kisser, I'm sorry. Oh my god, I, for whatever reason, I thought the bed they were in was way bigger than that. Oh shit. He's so good looking. Chris is gonna look at her like, hmm. About that. It would have been better to say that you were together just to the mom. Oh, he totally likes her. Oh, <gasps> Jonas! And Emma. What the f? He has a cut his hair. He looks so much better with short hair. What are those sideburns, boy? Ew. Oh, Jonas, don't be an asshole. Can you stop kissing, please? Okay. Oh. 
That's so cute though. Bare hør nå. Halla, dette er kanskje litt far out. Jeg crusher litt på henne, men skjønner ikke helt ass. Fra en bro til en annen, har du noe råd? Hvordan blomster liker hun liksom? Ha ha ha. It's not really a type of flower, it's just the effort. Oh, I wish we got more of this though so we could see him win Ava over and be a better person. Because <clears throat> right now I don't know how I feel about that pairing. They're cute together, but I don't know about... I don't know. I don't know if I trust him. <laughs> Are you jealous? Might be a bit in love with him. It's weird that it's the other way around. But does she really not like him or is she just, just saying that? Eh. If that was me and you in this position, I'd literally be like, go f yourself. If you think I'm gonna help you. Especially if he still has feelings for her. Aww. He's giving him actual advice. What a good man. Chris! This is so cool. <sighs> Are you? Oh, that's what that message said? Bitch, we ain't friends. Yeah, but you left. No, her best friends aren't going. You came to the wrong place, sorry. Her name's Christina. What? <laughs> it always starts with, I have a friend who... Oh, she's on Mount Vilda. I think Felda would react better if a friend talked to her. Mm. I'm still mind that her name is Christina. I don't know what I thought it was. Wait, <laughs> what? Oh, I get what she's saying. <laughs> I like how she's just pumping her up right now. <gasps> I'm in. No way. Oh, <gasps> yes. This is so cool that we're seeing all these different perspectives. Oh. I'm talking about Isik's birthday. He doesn't give a shit about ketchup. <laughs> All he cares is that him and the, his friends are there. This is so cute. He's too good for me. That's not true, Evan. I see a boyfriend is more than good enough. Someone who changed a pretty grumpy boy into a pretty happy boy. <laughs> That's so cute. There's your baby. Hmm. They are so cute together. I cannot get over it. 
Det er ligger på YouTube. Nej. Nej, men hvis du ikke skjønner tittelen, så får du ikke sett filmen. Did you make a movie video? You made a film. Oh, is this what everybody talks about when they say E6's birthday video? Yeah. Or, yeah, E6's birthday video? Men det var det ikke. Men ja, men det er ikke så langt nå. Nei. Grønne gardiner. Grønne gardiner. Wait, so, okay. I'm trying to think if I could guess. What would it be titled? I'll have to try and find that video. E6, sit down. Baby, it's not worth it. He's a piece of shit. It's okay. You're okay. He does not matter. Mm. Okay. Mm. <clears throat> is E6 standing up on something? Why is he taller? No way. Stop. If we get a William perspective right now, I'm gonna lose my shit. There's no way. <gasps> what? Oh my god. I can't believe they're getting a happy ending. I'm so happy. Talk to her about what? Meeting the parents? Wait, they're speaking English. What? <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why I didn't notice that. I'm so used to reading English that I just didn't even notice. Why are they speaking English? Damn, ask him what he's thinking. You can pretty much hear his thoughts. Look at the We all know you know how to write. Just take or something, I thought. Aww. Oh, is that what she's doing? She's writing the card? Yes, she does. <coughs> does he know that she didn't write that email? Oh, yeah, she does. <laughs> you don't need to try so hard. She will appreciate anything that you give her. <laughs> Maybe she misses her. William. Oh, man. Can you please talk to her? Don't hide stuff from her. Not after everything you guys have been through. Come on. <coughs> you know what the butterfly effect is? Concept in for Carl's story. Can you believe all my ships get their happy ending? I cannot. God, they've come so far. It's it's crazy how far they've come from his first appearance to now. It's just, he's a different person because of her and it's beautiful. Oh, I wanna be, I'll be your friend, Lynn. Can I just have the blue summer jewel? No, you can't just have is that what you're supposed to wear to those holiday things? Oh, she doesn't want to lose Nora again. Come on, Katara. 
att Mola är väldigt glad glad i oss, inte sant? Och ja, så när Mika är så fan han vill han, han är ju Nora är mycket bättre än han. Men hon måste ju få lov att leva livet sitt, inte sant? Skicka goda vänner för henne och stötta henne uansett vad hon gör. Även om hon inte alltid visar det så är Nora väldigt glad i oss. Och vill att vi ska ha det bra. She definitely does. Should we have another one? Oh my god, stop. Don't do this to me, it's too soon. Oh, you're not alone, Lynn. Just pass on my. Nope, 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 nope. Not getting me that easy, show. You're not getting me that easy. It's not gonna happen. That I am I. I'm fine. I'm fine. Ooh, I'm fine. Yeah, we lost that song. I'm determined to do this without crying, but I know it's not gonna happen, so. I don't know how much longer is in this episode, but I'm getting really nervous how much longer. 19 minutes, okay, we have time. We've got time, I don't have to stress yet. Look at it, they're talking. Look at them all just enjoying each other's company. I wondered who bought this. Sana looks so beautiful. <laughs> because it's the same. <laughs> if there's one thing you guys are good at, it's spices and herbs. <laughs> so not us, just you. <laughs> Look at them! They're so, they're literally husbands. Literally husbands. I wanna know, did the showrunner ever like confirm what happens with the characters after the last season? Like, do they get married at, in the end? Or like, you know, just do couples get engaged? Do they have kids? I wanna know. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, <laughs> Talk, bitch. We will just say that we are very glad for you, and that if you choose to flip in with William, then we will support you. So, is William going to stay in Norway this time? I'm not going to move. <gasps> oh, she's going to stay with them for a while. Or is he going to move in? <laughs> that's so funny. I think that's a good idea, though. Because they, I think they might have jumped the gun a little bit too soon last time. So taking it slow. That's okay. So Eskild's like, she chose us, bitch. <laughs> Look at now, he's so happier. <laughs> Hands off my man. <laughs> so we can share men. <laughs> Is six like an A in America? Like, is six the highest that you can get? <laughs> that's so cute. <laughs> you can do it, Chris. Is it a 
trenger noen å snakke med. Så har jeg hørt. Look at that face. Stop, don't make me. If, if I cry because of f***ing Chris, I'm gonna be pissed. Stop. Don't do- Stop. I'm fine. Stop! Of course, the time I cry is because of Chris. Oh my god. Oh my god, why is my camera all light? I think that's the first time we've ever like really seen her show motions. Ketchup and tomatoes are not the same thing. Ketchup is fantastic. Tomatoes are disgusting. I 100% agree with that. 100% agree with that. What the f***? What are you gonna do? Switch people? Interesting. <clears throat> Interesting. So they're really gonna... I don't hate it. I'm kind of confused though. He was like, I... Fuck me, right? Isn't Emma with Jonas though? Guess it's them two together again! It's ending how it started. <laughs> I like how they don't care that they're just like, what the you get it off, yeah. <clears throat> wow, they're really gonna end it with them back together just like how it started. There's still a lot more on her face. Oh, you said. Stop. Oh, oh my god, so it's pretty much insinuating that they're gonna end up together. I'm gonna cry through this entire speech, I know it, oh my god. Pretty much everybody helped. Dude, it just hit me that it's almost over. love that so much <sighs> I'm like god everything's like hitting me at once dude it only like hit me towards the end that that was gonna be the last scene whoa well it's crazy that I'm about to say this for the last time but that was the series finale of scam <sighs> okay <sighs> okay let me see see if I can get get through this without crying again. I want to start off 
by saying thank you. Exactly what the screen says, thank you for everything. You guys have no idea what it's meant to me that everyone stood by and like literally just watched me watch this series. And I felt like whenever I try to explain that to people, you know, what I do on YouTube, it just sounds so stupid. But then I don't care anymore when I think about the comments and what people say and when people will quote something that I said in the reaction or they'll respond to something that I said seven minutes into a video and it's like people actually listen to what I say and and it's like having a conversation with somebody and I wish I wish that reactions were a thing years ago when I would be alone watching my favorite show and something crazy would happen and I'd just be like oh my god I wish that I could be watching this with someone and just bounce it back and forth and talk about it and say what we liked and say what we didn't like and have a conversation about it and I feel like that's what reaction videos are for and a lot of people don't get it but people that love film and love tv and everything like that do get it and I'm speaking to you speaking to you guys and if you don't get it I hope that this this makes you get it it's like watching it with a friend especially your favorite series people that have watched Scam since the first season aired live are coming here because they want to see some stupid American girl react to it and watch something that was their entire life and see my thoughts and opinions on it from a different perspective. And that's what's so great about the reaction videos. You can be alone watching a show and it's over and you go YouTube and do scam series finale reaction and you can see what somebody else thought or you know how someone else reacted when Jonas started saying the speech or how someone else reacted when Chris kissed Emma you know, like it's I just think it's a lot more important than what people think and I'm not trying to say that it's the most important video on YouTube or it's the most like unique video on YouTube I'm not trying to say that but I'm just saying that it's such a great community and I don't care if people don't understand it because the scam fans have been some of the most amazing people that I've ever had the pleasure of speaking to. And if you've ever left a nice comment, left a like, talked to me about this show, I'm talking to you. Because thank you. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. My first video I ever uploaded was a reaction to The Walking Dead, and it did great. And that was also the first video that I got hate on um, for crying, which... I've come to realize is actually a good thing because people can see the real reaction and I'm not crying on purpose. I don't want to cry. You think I enjoy crying on camera and looking like an idiot? I don't. But that was the first video and I happened to cry in the first video that I ever made and it really, really made me not want to do it because people commented and said, oh, you're fake crying or oh, blah, 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 blah. But I realized very quickly that people would prefer that to me giving a fake reaction and ever since then I started scam that was really where my channel started growing and I started getting views and I never thought in a million years somebody would click on these videos or have their notifications on or wait to see what I upload next or ask for another upload and I know some people get super annoyed when people say oh when are you uploading this and I get it it's stressful but the fact that you care enough and you want to see me enough to ask is so amazing and I, I really cannot thank you enough for sticking with me and coming back to these reactions and, and watching every episode and just being there because this is, is such a dream and it's really due to scam why I've gotten where I have and really really thank you for everything and it doesn't hurt that this is one of my all-time favorite shows. It really doesn't. This show is such a fantastic show and major, major shout out to the creator and the writers, the directors, the actors, everybody involved in Scam for releasing such a unique, real, raw TV show. Because this genuinely feels like I'm watching kids in high school live their lives. I have never watched, I say this to a million people, but I've never watched a show that has had such a realistic high school experience and it's it's just beautiful such a beautifully done show and if you guys are still interested i will be reacting to every single scam so this is not the end of scam on my channel every single scam will be coming out on my channel and i will be reacting to all of them because 
I've honestly just fallen love fallen in love with this story and this concept and I'm not giving up on it. So if you would like that and you're a big scam fan, please stick around with me. Um, I, it would really mean a lot to me if I kept you guys. You guys are such great people and the best viewers, honestly, of any other shows I've ever reacted to. Like, let me just say, I've reacted to a number of shows. I have never had a comment section so nice than the scam comments. It's just like, even if I say the wrong thing or I understood something wrong, it's always a, hey, Kai, um, by the way, I think you misunderstood this. This is what it actually meant. Or, oh, hey, Kai, the subtitles were actually wrong. This is what it really said. It's never like, you're a fucking idiot, blah, blah, blah. How did you, how did you not understand that? Why, are, and why don't you understand that? Why didn't you understand that? Which is actually what I get, and I get that a lot. And the fact that I have never once, I don't think ever, gotten a bad comment on a scam reaction. I'm not even kidding. I don't think I've ever gotten a mean comment. It's it's just unbelievable how supportive the fans have been. And I know I'm rambling, but I really just want to say thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'm, I'm not just saying that. I'm not trying to be the cheesy YouTuber, YouTuber that's like, thank you so much. I love you guys so much. But I, I really, really do. And anytime that you guys are down to talk scam, tweet me. I will reply to you. Let's talk scam. I will always hold this show near and dear to my heart and hopefully one day I can get my mom to do reactions with me to this show and have her watch it with me because she really wants to watch it and she said maybe someday so I'm hoping I can get her to do that and then like, we can have a, like, a second swarm of scam videos come in with my mom. Honestly, thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really, really liked this episode. It was, it was so interesting to see these different perspectives of people that we've like never seen. And we haven't seen that many, obviously. We've just seen Ava, Isik, Nora, and Sana. But to see Vilda and Evan and Jonas, it's just like, it was it was cool. And the fact that I don't know what I expected for this episode. I just expected like a regular episode, right? But the fact that we got to see these different perspectives and all of it, it was just fantastic. Such a great wrap up. And this is just one of those episodes where like it feels final unfortunately like you've seen series finales and you're just kind of like is that really it is this is how, is this how they're ending my favorite show but this it felt final and it felt it felt like a goodbye and that breaks my heart but it felt good to have them happily wrap up in a way that everybody was getting along and Ingrid and Sarah were at Sana's party and it's just like everything ended up good and they didn't hate each other. No one's fighting anymore. It just felt very, oh, it just, it felt good to see everybody get their happy ending. And even though Vilda's going through the stuff with her mom, Chris came out and was like, I will always, always be here for you no matter what. And th that scene just like, oh my God, got me, got me so bad. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. There's not much that I can say about this episode because it not too much, um, like added to the story. It just kind of wrapped things up. But 10 out of 10 for the whole series. Absolutely, absolutely loved this show. I don't think that it's hit me that I'm never going to watch it again. I mean, I'm going to watch it again. Of course, I'm going to watch it again. But I don't think it's hit me that there's never going to be more of it. And I don't know. For just It just felt like it came so fast. And I know it probably didn't seem like that when you guys were watching it. But I remember, like, literally yesterday watching season one. And I liked it. And it was probably like an 8 out of 10 for me, 8 out of 10 for me at that point, just because, you know, you grow more attached to these characters as time goes on. And then season two came around and I was like, oh shit, like I really love the show. And then season three came along and I just, it just grew as time went on. Not because the season was better, but just because, because I grew attached to these characters and the community and everything. And it's just been such an amazing opportunity to be a part of it. It really has. And I just, again, I want to say thank you Thank you to everybody that's watching this. Thank you to everybody involved in Scam for the show. And thank you. Thank you. I know I, I said this a hundred times, but for everybody that watched and became a Patreon for the uncut reactions, I cannot explain how much it means to me. And it's, it really is such an amazing feeling to know that people care enough to do that and to spend their money on me and seeing more of this. And it's just... Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, I don't I don't have that much to say about the episode. I'm I'm super happy with the way everything wrapped up and finally getting to see some of these other characters and their perspective of things. Um I still would love his fifth season with Vilda. Scam creators, make it happen. 
Um, but I know that the show is, is long over, so it'd be a little bit difficult probably to get everybody together to do it. Um, but nonetheless, I would love it if they did. But yeah, guys, I absolutely love this finale. I think that is just about all that I have to say, though. I will see you all very soon. Please stick around because I will be reacting to all the scams that are put out. So if you want, please stick with me and you will see way more scam content. And that would mean everything to me if you did. Um, but if not, I totally understand and I get it. But I love you anyway. I will see you guys very soon. Thank you for watching.